Low rain chances will slowly kind of work their way out of the Brazos Valley over the next 24 to 36 hours, but we have a cold front headed this way we'll be talking about here in just a second. Here's a current look out there, a live out look out there late this afternoon through the early evening. Some scattered showers around the region, but in general, temperatures have managed to get into the upper 60s to low 70s. We got up to the low 70s briefly. We've dropped in the 60s, though, with some of that rain cool there in place. Visible satellite clouds still pretty thick earlier today, but we're seeing some breaks in those clouds. Might see a couple breaks in the clouds with a little bit of sunshine later this afternoon through the early evening, but the sun will set pretty quickly here over the next couple of hours. Here's a look at your pinpoint radar as we scan into a couple of these. There's just a few isolated showers here and there, but most of the heavier activity has been off to our south, down towards Houston and near the coast, where we've had a couple of severe thunderstorm warnings, even a tornado warning or two down there. I don't think we should be concerned about that, but uh, we won't also see any of the flooding like they're seeing in portions of Houston. There are a couple of scattered showers that continue to roll through the area, but that'll probably be about it through this evening. Here's your pinpoint forecast, keeping that isolated rain chance in here through overnight and even through early tomorrow morning as you make your commute into work and even into school. And still a couple of isolated showers through around lunchtime tomorrow before things kind of wrap up towards mid to late afternoon. And then our next cold front comes in here Tuesday morning. That frontal boundary starts to shift further south. And then isolated showers and maybe a thunderstorm or two works their way through the area late Tuesday morning through the early afternoon. That should wrap up by Tuesday evening and things should quiet down after that. There's that front coming through. Temperatures will certainly be dropping just a little bit, but 64 for tonight, an isolated shower or two. For tomorrow, highs in the low 80s with an isolated storm or two earlier in the day and then continuing to the afternoon. 40% chance for some rain on Tuesday with some breezy conditions developing behind this cold front. We won't really drop off too much with temperatures in the 70s, 80 by the time we get to next weekend.